So now going to the last stage. Will I be able to beat the game? Will I be able to not completely fail the fight? Will I be able to capture Virtue of Wind God? See that in an instant. That was failed. That was some epic failure. <laughs> anyway, I still have five lives, so uh, I don't really care. This stage is designed around uh, you bombing to get more faith. So do use your bombs. Because uh, it's designed for you to use them. Just stay there, stream a little bit, and bomb. Look at my faith. It's increasing quite a lot. Yeah, quite a lot. Let's bomb again. And then the death fairy. Uh, you want, I did indeed bomb one too many times though, because here I'm going to stay at four something power. Yeah. I wasn't very confident, and I didn't do my item collecting very well. Bah. It doesn't really matter. <clears throat> Who is it that calls for me? Wow, she's big. <laughs> hey, she knows me. <laughs> yeah. So, what's your name, lady? Yeah, ju just stop bothering us. No, you don't. Kanako Yasaka. Hey, why is, isn't it Kanako Moria? I wonder. Uh, now for the final boss fight. Her opener is one of the hardest attacks. It's it's fair. It's just extremely hard, and if my computer lags, it's not going to help me. However, I'm doing extremely well. Hell yeah! Opener capture. This makes me happy. First spell card is absolutely tri trivial when you understand how aim, how misdirection and streaming work. <laughs> that was close. Uh, second non-spell is the most stupid thing ever. Just go right, left, right, left, right, left. Do start with right, otherwise you are going to fail. Second spell is very, very evil. It might not look that hard, but there's lots of unfairness regarding the hitbox size of the bullets. I still did it. Uh, non-spell, this one is uh, strange. There's some bullets bouncing off, off the wall, which is never a good thing for the player. Try and stay around the middle, it usually works. Yamato Taurus. The, she, the knives go through the wall in a Pac-Man style thing. For those who don't know, in math we actually call that kind of symmetry a Taurus, so it makes sense. Last, last non-spell. She gets invincible for long periods of time, which is frankly annoying. There's three phases. The bubbles, the knives, and the round bullets. And I'm not under her when she's vulnerable. Both the bubble and the knives are completely aimed based on where you are. So the knives is streaming and the bubbles is almost streaming too. Come on! Kanako being evil. Oh, what the hell is happening? Just let me attack you. There we go. Almost there. Uh, this spell card is completely stupid. As you can see, I have quite a, a weak record against it. And I just survived somehow. Doing excellent, but problem is that you can't damage her. Ah, hitbox. Uh, I would have liked to capture this. And now the last attack of the game: Virtue of Wind God. This is by far, 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 far the best attack in the game. It's incredibly fun. 
incredibly hard, well not incredibly hard, but very hard, and very very long like every final spell card in the series. Uh, I very often practice this final stage just to get, just to play against this attack. I captured it only once in my 58 uh, Rimu tries and I guess more for other characters too and I did not capture it there. Still doing pretty well. Maybe not. Maybe not. <laughs> yeah. I'm getting walled all over the place. It's a mix of uh, macro and mi micro dodging. I did the micro quite badly here. And here we go! That, folks, is the end of the game. As usual, I'm going to cut the ending sequence right now. And this, folks, is the end of Toho Fujin Roku Mountain of Faith. Uh, if you think about this run, you'll notice that I think 100% of my deaths were caused by me not want, not bombing when I should have. There were no actual, uh, let's say, legit deaths where I just something was just too hard and I didn't have any bombs left. Uh, this I hope will show everyone that this game is freaking easy for Toho. Uh, I think that. Anyone should be able to 1cc this on normal, and even with a good plan, I think it might be possible to 1cc this game in Lunatic without actually learning to dodge stuff. Not completely sure, but I think. Uh, I like the background here, it's different from the usual style, yeah. Actual photos, I think. Looks nice. Um, yeah, thanks for thanking me. Yeah, playing this was great. No prob, Zoom. Next tree. You're really good! Hell yeah! And with the main storyline finished, I beat my high score. Somehow. I really don't think I played well at all. Uh, that goes to show how much I practice this game, I guess. I have no interest in uh, saving my replay, and that's it. Next time we're going to play the extra stage where we face <coughs> one of the bosses of the game as a mid boss, plus uh, a new boss who as usual we have about 10 spell cards. I don't care about the right track mode. Uh, yeah, that's it, thanks for watching, please uh, leave your comments if you have some, and see you next time, bye!